What's up guys, so in this video, I'm gonna be going more in detail and I'm gonna give you guys some gems about state funds, all right? So we're gonna go more in specifics. And so if you guys find this video useful at all, please guys, give us a like, throw some comments down there, some, some comments to support, or if you guys have some questions, it helps me out to know that you guys like this content and it helps me make more content. And so it'll, you know, and I'll help you guys out because I'll be giving you guys more information, helping you guys kill state funds. All right. So I'm going to be going over um, some of the most asked questions and some of the stuff I didn't go over in the last videos. And so stick around for the last one, too, guys, because all of these are important. But the last one is a question I've been getting all the time. So just make sure you stay and stick around for that one. All right. So without further ado, let's go straight into it. All right. So one question one that I always get is becoming an investigator does my state want me to become an investigator how does that work what is it you know so let me give you an example for california because i'm in california and i specialize in california so in california they want you to become an investigator it's for tax reasons and just so they know who's out there you know doing these state funds um that's it's not a big deal guys it's not you, you don't have to uh fill anything out or anything like that or you don't have to take a test nothing like that you just have to give them your basic information and boom you're an investigator good to go in california some other states really don't care at all some states don't even know what that is if you can ask somebody about that and they'll wouldn't even know what you're talking about so so it's different in every state and so by saying that i want to get into the next topic is all states are different all right i wanted to go ahead and say this because a lot of you guys want to ask me personal questions about your personal state guys i just want to let you know that every state is different and every law is different or every state has different laws so i can't go ahead and start telling you exact detail and it's impossible to know all 50 i mean i could know all 50 states but i'm more focused on california but i can figure out your state um, I always give my students top priority. So if you join my program, I'll give you top priority. And I have a whole list of some of the questions that you guys already have in a spreadsheet. So we can go ahead and get those answered quickly. And I know how to find these answers quickly. All right. So top students get top priority. If you're not my student, um, you can go ahead and DM me. But I just want to let you know that it's going to be take you it might take a little while or I might not, not even know the answer. Um, but if you're my student, of course, I give you top priority and I'll figure out the answer for you. <laughs> Third question is getting paid. How, how does that how does that work? How do you even get paid? All right. So when you guys go ahead and do everything correctly, when you become an investigator, you get your paperwork right. Um, now, the state, either the state like California is going to split the check for you. And it's super simple because what they do is when you fill out that application and everything's good to go they'll just split it they'll give your client they'll mail your client their check they'll mail you your check separate your client doesn't even see what you make perfect okay but in different states you will have to go ahead and wait until your client gets paid and then you will have to get your portion from your client and this is the reason why i tell my students to go ahead and sign two contracts because when you sign the second one now, if this, the client tries to run away, now you have an authority to go ahead and pursue legal action, which doesn't really happen, only happens if you have a very sketchy client. And guys, these I've never had that problem, but you can run into that problem because it's super easy for someone to get their money and just bail on you. All right. So next thing is percentage. A lot of you guys have questions on the percentage. You guys hear that Cali has 10%. You guys get a 10% commission. Uh, commission. What about other states? All right, guys. So like I said, some states don't even do state funds, while others have a very low percentage. And I wouldn't even want you guys to go and chase those deals because it doesn't really make sense. Um, but I mean, if you get a lot of deals, I guess, but you know, I, I wouldn't even re recommend that. All right. So, and some states don't have any restrictions on percentage, but like I said, guys, if you guys are going and you're taking advantage of your clients, and some reason you get into legal tr trouble, the judge is not going to be in your favor. They're going to see you as taking advantage and then you're just going to get screwed over. So do everything. Um, you know, if you're doing a lot of work, of course, charge a little bit more. But it's like I said, it's up to you guys. Um, but don't get greedy because becoming greedy is a good way to go ahead and kill any business, not just this business. All right. Now, list. 
I want to go more in detail about the list. I know so much questions on this one. The list, very, very common. With the list, for California, you get an automatic list. It gives you the name, where they live. It's perfect, okay? But in different states, some states don't even have a list. Some states print it on a newspaper. It's hard to figure out every state, and I know majority of them, but some of them don't even have a list. And if they do have a list, they won't show you the amount. And if they, it just gets very complicated. So with California, just show their name, their uh, last known address. It gives you um, what type of account that they're that they have and the state funds. Um, it gives you a lot of information for them, but other states might not even show you their name. It just shows you the amount or it just gives you the name and uh, doesn't even show you the amount. So it's very difficult for some states. But like I said, if, you ha if you're having trouble with some states, it's okay because different states allow you to go ahead and th they'll let you work even though you don't live in that state, if that makes sense, all right? So you can work in a different, so if I'm in California, I can work in Texas um, and not even worry about California, okay? And guys, I also wanna let you know that state funds is very extremely unsaturated. So get in while you can before, because I feel like this business is about to start booming. So get in now and make money now before, you know, it just gets saturated, you know? It's a good way to make money um and oh a last thing is the question about do i have to pay for these um lists the list that you get from the state all right some states require you to pay them some are expensive some like in california it's free so it just honestly depends oh and the last thing i wanted to mention as well is like I said, I kind of mentioned it before, but if you're in a state that doesn't allow state funds, you can go into a state that does. So you guys are all set. You don't, you don't have to worry if you guys join state funds, you guys are good because you can do a different state, even if your state doesn't do it. Or if your state is weird on the regulations, um, you, you'll, you'll be okay, all right? Um, and that's basically it for the state funds. This is one of the most questions I get. So I wanted to go ahead and get more in detail. Like I said, guys, if you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comment. If you found this video useful, please like it. And if you guys want more information, you guys can always DM me on Instagram. Uh, my business page is Dan's Biz 101. I'll put it in this video. Um, and you go in the link, go in the description if you want the course or anything like that. All right, so with that said, peace. And I hope you guys are making money 2020, 2021. All right.